Hey guys, it's Katie. And Abby. And today we are here to talk to you about the differences between kids back when we were kids and kids today. Yeah. Back when I was a youngin, computer time was a privilege. I would always be on either webkins or like Club Penguin or something or emailing my friends because that was the only way to communicate with them. Now, it's all about social media. Kids are on the phones, the laptops, or even like TV. Always checking other people's statuses, posting their own things. They're concerned about the likes and everything. Back when we were younger, TV, I would only be able to watch like one show before I would go to bed. I'd have a sleep timer on, right? I'd only have it for 20 minutes. And I'd always watch like Scooby-Doo or something. I would watch Cyber Chase. Oh, that would be a good one. Yes. That's such a good one. And now we have Netflix and like TiVo where we can record shows and watch them later or like on demand where we can just like, we have all this access to watch as much TV as we kind of want now. Which is nice sometimes, but then I also feel like it's encringing upon our social time with other people. Yeah. And the encringing is the word that I made up. So I don't know if you remember, but back in like the early 2000s, the clothing was very funky. We would wear layers, we'd wear layers all these like, bright colors. I don't know if you watched iCarly recently, but <laughs> their outfits are basically what we used to wear all the time. Yeah. And now it's just kids are wearing crop tops and short shorts and it's like, sometimes you need the to butts cover are a little more. Out. Yeah. yeah. Now the video games, back then it was like Mario Kart and, and Mario Party. Super was, Smash Bros. Mario. Oh. That was the best one when you got to play against your friends with like the stars yeah. game and the like mini games. Oh, I was so good at that. I beat you every oh, time. Please. I was bomb at the. We will go down. Okay. After this, we, we will, will go down. down. I I I'm I gonna will beat you. you. I will beat you. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> mm -mm. <laughs> we'll find out. All right, and now the video games are like Call of Duty and like shooting games and all these insane things that like ten-year-old boys are playing. And it's just not the same as it used to be. You know, you used to play against your friends like for fun, like fun rivalry, like we just had about like, the <laughs> Mario thing. You know, but now it's just like a lot of violence. Okay, so back then, it was all about collecting and what like your hobbies were. And personally, me and Katie were a big fan of the silly bands, which are like rubber bands, but they're in shapes. shapes of things. I don't know if you guys used to do I this. I think this is a truck or like a limo. This is definitely a cowboy. We used to trade them at school. It was just yeah. thing that everybody would do. It was so fun. I will trade you anything for that one. This yellow squiggle. Yeah. Give me all your pink ones. Done. We also collected take apart erasers, which are like the really like cute erasers. And you can take them, oh, you can take them apart basically like that. And you can use them as erasers, but we would always trade them, and they were just more for like to play with and to if you were bored during class, take apart and put back together and build yes. your own ice cream cones or whatever. So fun. And we'd also collect Mighty Beans. Mighty Beans was another cool one. Beanie Babies. Beanie, I have American so Girl Dolls. Yes, I have so many American Girl Dolls. I have like And nine. all the clothes, Barbies. Oh my god, I have the collectors. Ruby Barbies. Girls. Yes, Ruby Girls. Oh, Polly Pockets. Pokemon Designs. cards and Yu-Gi-Oh cards. I still have some in here. Wait, what energy is this? I don't know. It's just an energy one. Oh, here's another one. Oh, we got a Kakuna. Pokemon Go is the bomb. I have like three Kakunas on there. I'm trying to evolve them. Yeah, I have like five. Oh. All right, and nowadays kids are only concerned about collecting followers on Twitter. It's like, what celebrities follow you or how many followers do you have? Oh my God, Katie. What? You won't believe who just followed me. Who? James McFay. Oh my God, no. Tell him that Brad needs to follow me. Oh no, I'm literally gonna cry. Oh my God, oh my God. Okay, so back then, a lot of kids like were all ramped up and cared about their Tamagotchi. You know, like the little... Oh yes. The Tamagotchi was all that I cared about. I, I carried had, this like, thing around me everywhere. I had like five. Yeah. And I was, I was like so stressed I had, like, out. I all connected to each other and I'd be like, which one is crying? Which one needs to yeah. be fed? I can't tell. But Katie, come on, it's time for dinner. Wait, I gotta finish feeding my Tamagotchi. He's gonna die. Katie. Mom, please. <laughs> And then also like the Nintendogs thing, you had to make sure your dogs were still good and happy. Uh -huh. And it was just like, that's what you were concerned about. Now, all kids care about is how many likes your Instagram gets, or how many favorites on Twitter, or likes on Facebook, how you know? How many retweets. Katie, can you like my Instagram photo? It only has 207 likes. Oh, fine, I'll toss you a like. Thank you. 
Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure to give it a big, big thumbs up to let us know you did. Social media is down below. Follow us, tweet us, let us know what you think. Let um, us know if we missed anything of what you did when you were younger exactly. versus now. Comment it down below or tweet it or Instagram it to us somehow. And yeah, all right, we'll see you guys next Monday. Bye. This is Katie. And Abby. <laughs>